There was a time when the U.S. state of California was an island. This wasn't a far off time in the past when the world was still forming. It was actually still an island as recently as the 18th century. The massive island of California was separated from the continental United States by a strait known as the Gulf of California. The island of California stretched nearly the entire North American Pacific coast and was thought of as an island paradise. It was also one of the biggest mapping errors in human history. The first recorded mention of the island of California is noted in a romance novel titled Las Serges de Esplandian, published in 1510. The author, Garcia Rodriguez de Montalvo, described the island as a terrestrial paradise, populated by scores of beautiful Amazonian women with no man in sight. Now, you're probably thinking that no accomplished scholar would take a romance novel as historical canon, but that seems to be nearly exactly what happened. In 1533, Fortun Jimenez, an explorer sent by Cortes, the famous Spanish conquistador, discovered the Baja Peninsula and noted the extremely long island nature of the landmass. Without the reference that the northern portion of the land provided and with the idea of the land as an island implanted in their memories from this early romance novel, they improperly reported the mythical island did, in fact, exist. Cortes was operating on limited knowledge of the area but was strong strongly persuaded to believe that it was similar to the mythical island of California, reported in Las Serges de Esplandian. In order to confirm the initial findings, he sent a navigator down to the area to investigate. What the navigator found was that the island appeared to be a peninsula, a finding that one might assume stopped the myth of California being an island from propagating. But alas, it did not. Due to the rather flawed capabilities of explorers and mappers in the 17th and 18th century, no one was able to confirm that the area of California was a peninsula, and as a result, some influential mapmakers drew the region as a large island. Popular opinion slowly shifted to the area being a peninsula, but the original map continued to be copied all the way to the mid-1700s. The matter was finally put to rest when a team of Jesuit missionary explorers, led by Juan Bautista de Anza traveled to the area around 1774 to 1776, and they confirmed that no such island of California existed. After the historic expedition, California suddenly became connected to the North American continent. Between 1530 and 1750, over a period of over 200 years in fairly recent history, a large portion of the world wholeheartedly believed that California was, in fact, a massive island. This massive mapping error is one of the most famous and most faulty in all of human history.